Welcome back. Today we're taking a look at the Horton H0229 version 3, which was an experimental flying wing the Germans developed at the end of the war. Uh, it uses jets now with the jet update for Stormworks. I actually built this a long time ago using uh, the fans in the game and uh, it barely flew. But now with jet technology, it is possible to fly like a jet plane, if you know what I mean. All right, so today we're going to go ahead and start up the engines, get in the air, and probably not land, but uh, show you what it looks like. So this is our demo flight. All right, so turn off the brakes. You want to put the throttle setting to about 20, just to get the engines at a point where we can taxi around. It's worth noting that some of the jets, excuse me, some of the jets on the workshop are now using PIDs to limit um, how fast the engine moves up and down with RPS and also use the throttle to set the RPS instead of using the throttle to set the engines directly. So this plane uses no modern technology, so it is using the throttle directly on the engines and will um, make the RPS climb really rapidly if you're not careful. So we're going to start moving. So uh, what you want to do is baby the throttle between 15 and 20 on the ground. And then um, once you are in the air, you can power up a little bit. I forgot. I think it's about 30 maybe. I can't remember. But you don't want to um, go too far up on your throttle the engines will blow pretty quickly so I'm just gonna go ahead and do a awkward uh, takeoff so I'm going about 30 40 yeah that is climbing really fast all right so I'm gonna put it down to about 20 20 20 throttle Ooh, it's still climbing I have not flown this plane for a while, so I forgot the best setting for this plane, but 20 seems really high right now. All right, I'm going to back it off to 10. All right, so 15. I think 20 is good. No, 15. All right, 17. I think 17 is a magic number. Yeah, it was about 17. All right, so we just flew straight up in the air. Oh, we are high. Where are we? I don't have any gauges for the poor plane. Okay, so let's take it back down. All right, so while we were playing with the throttle, whoa, while we were playing with the throttle, we went way high. So uh, now we are back down on the deck, and we are... Just taking a look at the plane, and uh, it flies really nice. So point 0.17 is your throttle setting you want to use with this plane for cruising. Uh, be careful on those takeoffs because the front landing gear is a little weak and will collapse, so you'll have to watch that. Do we have a trim? No trim. So we have no trim on this plane, and it's flying relatively level. Well, that's it for today. Thanks for joining me. I'm going to go ahead and keep demoing uh, the planes as I update them and release them. So if you like World War II planes, mainly World War II planes, go ahead and subscribe. And uh, you'll know when new planes are coming out. So for right now, let's go ahead and say goodbye to both you and the poor Horton Ho 229 version 3. Oh, I just love blowing up the planes for fun at the end. All right, that is it. See you next time. Can I do a water landing?